Ship strikes kill about 80 whales each year off the California coast. Now, UCSB scientists are developing new technology to prevent that from happening. News Channel reporter Scott Sheehan went out on the water to get a first-hand look at how this technology works. Humpback whales and blue whales are among the largest mammals on the planet. Humpback whales can grow up to 50 feet long, while blue whales can be twice that length. But these ocean giants have a problem. Ships moving through the areas where they feed. As these populations are recovering, they're now facing other threats, like uh, collisions with large ships and also fishing gear entanglement. University of California Santa Barbara scientist Morgan Vasali says roughly 80 whales die each year in collisions with ships along the California coast. Now UCSB researchers are working on new technology called Whale Safe. It uses three components to predict where whales will be underwater microphones to listen to them, oceanic temperatures to predict feeding areas, and community scientists and whale watchers to document sightings. Real-time data on whale activity that we can then get out to the shipping industry so they know when to slow down to help protect these endangered species. On our trip, we found whales swimming in some dangerous places. And we're almost to the shipping lanes, which you can see here, which is also where we've seen a lot of whale activity recently. Condor Express Captain David Beezer logs daily sightings for whale safe. He's eager to see real-time updates. Out to the islands, and I think overall the, the combination of technologies that the app's going to use will be really beneficial in the long run. Fasali says even the largest animals on the planet can be hard to spot from the captain's deck, and this app will better protect the whales. In Santa Barbara Channel, I'm News Channel reporter Scott Sheehan.